Hello guys, it's Angelina and Dima here. In this video I want to share with you the equipment from the company Unigear that we collaborate with for this video. The items included are two pairs of skiing gloves and an audio headset for a skiing helmet. We have already collaborated with Unigear before and we know that the quality of their products is up to standard. Winter adventures, especially in the mountains, are not over yet this season, so these products could be of interest to you, especially if you are into skiing. Let's start with the gloves. These gloves are designed primarily for skiing, but it's worth noting that they can be used not only with skis, but also for winter hikes, specifically the lighter ones. You can also use these gloves for biking. However, for safety reasons, we cannot recommend these gloves for motorcycle riding, as motorcycles have specific requirements. The gloves come in plastic packaging with branded tags indicating their insulation and resistant to moisture and direct water exposure. This is crucial for skiing, especially if you are a beginner and often find yourself in contact with snow. The excellent water protection ensures that your hands stay dry during the ride. The upper part of the gloves is made of durable material that repels water with sturdy stitching. Additionally, there is a small pocket on the upper part of the gloves, which is very convenient for storing small items. These pockets are present on both gloves. The lock is also reliable and protected by a rubber gasket to prevent moisture from entering the pocket. The gloves also feature a clip, a velcro strap that can be tightly secured to prevent snow from getting in through the sleeve and thus securely fasten the glove to the hand. In addition to the strap, there is an elastic band with a quick clasp that can further seal the glove completely preventing snow and water from getting inside. Since these gloves are designed for skiing, they come with an additional elastic band with a ring, specifically designed to attach to a ski pole. On the reverse side, the gloves feature a combination material consisting of faux leather, also securely stitched. The gloves also have a patch on the index finger, specifically for using your phone. This can be really useful, as you won't have to constantly take off your gloves, even just to quickly check messages. Inside, the gloves consist of a fleece-like material, which is pleasant to the touch and immediately begins to warm your hands due to the additional layer inside, which is felt when pressed. The manufacturer claims that despite the gloves being waterproof, the materials are breathable, so your hands won't sweat inside. Additionally, the gloves can be connected to each other, which is very convenient and practical for transportation. The second pair of gloves serves a different purpose. These gloves are intended for moderate cold weather and biking trips. Externally, these gloves look more elegant, without any unnecessary details, making them suitable for everyday wear. However, these gloves also have high resistance to water and moisture. The upper side of the gloves is made of uniform material. There are no pockets on these gloves. On the reverse side, the gloves have a faux leather material, as well as special patches on the index and thumb fingers to allow you to use your phone without removing the gloves. The gloves can also be fastened together. Now moving on to the headset. This is a headset specifically designed for ski helmets with the possibility of placing the headset inside. The speakers come in a cardboard box and also have their own story case for permanent storage. This is very convenient, because without the case, the speakers could easily be lost in a backpack. Externally, the case is covered in faux leather and is very durable against impacts and damage. Inside we see two speakers, each with its own designated spot in the case. Additionally, inside the case there is a mesh where the charging cable is placed. This cable is special and will always need to be taken with you. The cable has two contacts for each of the speakers. The speakers are made of plastic, but the speaker grill is made of metal, providing serious protections against any potential damage to the speakers inside. Behind this grill we see another mesh material providing additional protection against moisture entering the speaker. All these measures are taken for the same reason prevent moisture and water damage. The speakers have large power buttons that cover almost the entire surface. This is intentional, allowing you to easily switch tracks and answer calls while wearing gloves and a helmet. Additionally, next to the button there is a light indicator that signals when the device is on and during charging. On the side of the speakers there is a small opening for the microphone. Since it's Bluetooth 5, the connection should be good. However, we cannot guarantee that there will be a good connection with the microphone on all phones. Also on the side, there is a charging pad. Charging cable is compatible with both speakers, and there is no need to worry about the correct connection. As for the main purpose, which is sound, the sound produced by these speakers is indeed loud. It's not top-of-the-line sound, but we can't compare them to our studio headphones. However, it's pleasant sound for a Bluetooth headset. 
Each of these speakers has a built-in battery of 165 mAh, which allows for up to 10 hours of music playback. But remember, this is under the condition of 20 degrees Celsius. There are no exact data on at what volume these headphones will last for 10 hours. But it's safe to assume that they should last for about 5 hours. In conclusion, we think these are quality products from Unigear. As for the speakers for the skin helmet, we don't have a skin helmet, so we cannot fully test them while snowboarding down a snowy mountain slope. However, we have seen their potential for such an adventure and are confident that the speakers will find their owner. We didn't like that the speakers sit not as securely as we would like in the case. And perhaps it would have been better to make a deeper seating for the speakers in the case. The special cable that you can't forget to take with you on a trip can be an issue and also it would be desirable to make the speakers entirely out of metal for stronger protection. And that is all for today. Now we're interested to hear from you, share your experiences and adventures in winter. What device can't you imagine winter outdoor activities without? We'll be interested to read your comments. In the next video we're going to release very soon, we'll be sharing our tips and tricks about wild camping, so make sure not to miss it. Thank you for watching guys and until next one. See you!